Hey, my first guest joining us live in our Tower District studios this afternoon, we have Tamar. Uh, do- well, I'm gonna. I'll, I'll say Dr. Lawful Brown, right? Yes, that's correct. Okay, but your first name is. My first name is Tamar. You can call me Tamar. Oh, okay. All right, cool. Well, uh, Dr. Tamar, we'll go with that. <laughs> okay. Uh, thanks for joining us today. Thank you for having me, Austin. So, okay, let's let's start off with your background. Yeah. In in the medical world, take it away. Well, I'm a pharmacist. I've been a pharmacist for 17 years, and along that journey of being a pharmacist, I. Became, became really interested in nutrition. You know, as a pharmacist, we focus so much on medicine to help people get better, but I started understanding that from the foods we eat, we can have uh, an effect on our health where we can eventually get off of some medications. Uh, so my focus now became combining my knowledge of pharmacy as, as well as um, with nutrition and encouraging other people to really focus on their nutrition to improve their health as well. So you also represent the lifebalance.com. Let's talk about what that is. Yes, Life Balance is my business. I created it uh, to provide health con- consultations uh, to people who are interested in pretty much feeling better. You know, your life can drag us down. We can feel tired. We don't have time to take care of ourselves. And uh, so I provide health consulting services to help clients uh, reevaluate what's going on in their lives with their, with their nutrition, with their exercise routine. How are they on self-care? Are they even taking time out for themselves? Because um, what I found is taking all these into consideration, we can have a huge improvement in our health and how we feel on a day-to-day basis. So how important is is the nutrition aspect? It's very important. For example, you can exercise Mm -hmm. day in, day out and eat hamburgers and french fries, but what's really going on in your body? And are you really going to see any great effects um, in your health? You know, so, but when you exercise and perhaps change that burger to a salad with maybe some chicken on it or um, a lower amount of carbs in your nutrition, you, know, you, you start getting the nutrients that your body needs to really function on a cellular level. You know, one of the things is uh, diabetes. A lot of people deal with that. Yeah. Um, a lot of people are pre-diabetic. Yes. Uh, what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, as far as pre-diabetes, you can, to a certain extent, prevent it from progressing to diabetes by focusing on your nutrition. And there are tests that are out there that can be done to, to let you know if you're at a risk for diabetes or even in a pre-diabetic state. Um, for example, your blood test, you can check your what they call your hemoglobin A1C, which pretty much lets you know um, how, how much sugar is in your blood. And um, you can also check your insulin levels before you even get to the point of actually having diabetes. And that can be an early indicator as to whether you're pre-diabetic or not. Now, nutrition comes into play um, when you're pre-diabetic, definitely. Um, when you start reducing the amount of carbohydrates that you take, you know, instead of a full sandwich, you can have maybe a flatbread, which has a lower amount of carbs. Or you can switch to other alternatives that you know, you don't have a high amount of carbohydrate intake. Um, If someone is pre-diabetic, it's important that they do start paying attention to their nutrition and definitely implement an exercise. Like, we usually recommend 30 minutes a day, five days a week. It's really not that much. Right, right? and when you think about it in a 24-hour day. Yeah, 30 minutes. It's it's doable. How do you get back into that mindset, though? I think that's the hardest problem for people, and not just – working out, but eating right. It's like, it's a whole psyche that you have to It definitely change. is, Austin, and it's not easy. I, it wasn't easy for me. It took me years to actually get into a mindset of um, doing healthy things on a regular basis, and it still is a challenge. Um, and that's where uh, my program with Life Balance comes in. I have a protocol called the, the Sense RX, the Sense Prescription, and as a health consultant and health coach, I, I walk through people walk people through that process, pretty much hold their hands to help them stay on track and stay motivated to implement these lifestyle changes for better health. Um, when you work with some of your clients, what, what's the feedback? What are people saying? Well, the, they're amazed by the genetic testing because that's where it all starts. It's very personalized. We do what's called neutrogenomic testing where um, based on your genes, your genes can tell you what type of foods will be best for you, for your health what type of exercise you should do. 
And then from there, I also incorporate the, the self-care routine, you know, because if we're going to be stressed in our lives, you can do whatever you want. It's not really going to work that well, right? Um, so the feedback is they're amazed that their genetics, they could learn so much from their genetics. As we are heading into, of course, the holiday season, mm-hmm. a lot of people are kind of on a crunch to get healthy, like, immediately, you know, for those mm-hmm. pictures and to see <laughs> those people, especially over the last couple of years when... I mean, last Christmas, COVID wasn't as bad, but then Christmas before was a nightmare. Uh, This year is probably going to be a little bit different. More people will be able to see their families. Um, What advice would you have for for folks that are like, I want to to jump into something fast and healthy fast? You know, do you want long-term results or do you want short-term results, right? (laughs) So ultimately, we want to have long-term results that are sustainable. And so there are over 100 diets out there. So if you want to lose weight fast, you can try any one of those diets, and it's probably going to work if you stick to it. But after that diet, what's going to happen, right? And what I encourage my clients to do is to um, help them find a a way that's sustainable for them to eat, something that they can maintain. Now, if the holidays come around or there's a birthday party or or an anniversary, and they want to splurge a little bit, eat a little bit more than they usually eat, or indulge in mm-hmm. a chocolate piece of chocolate cake when they usually don't. That's that's fine, you know. That's it's, okay. It's, not, it's it's about not doing it every day. Every day, <laughs> every day is a problem. Every day is when we start having those health, those long-term health issues. Uh, we've got about a minute left. Anything else you offer uh, through the life balance? Well, through life balance, as a, as a pharmacist, I do use those skills for any of my clients that do have complex medications okay. um, to help educate them on it. And um, I also want to let everyone know about a webinar I have on Sunday, October 24th at 3 p.m. So that's this Sunday, right? That's this yeah. Sunday okay. at 3 p.m. It's called, um, sorry, it's called How, How Genes Impact Your, your Weight. So it's, it's called Make Sense of, your, of Weight Loss. Okay. Oh, yeah, How, here it is. Yes, We're Make Sense of it. Weight Loss, How Genes Play a Role. And I think it will be very interesting. Um, people find that very interesting to discover how genes actually play a role in that. Process. So people can learn more at uh, thelifebalance.com, uh, uh, yes. and they can sign up uh, for that webinar this Sunday. They can if they go to thelifebalance.com. Perfect. Yes. And then uh, give your phone number. It is 323-880-2026. I learned a lot today. <laughs> Thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me, Austin. Appreciate it. Uh, check uh, Dr. Tamar, Dr. Lawful Brown uh, out today online. Yes. And if you have some time this weekend, again, check out that webinar. Thank you. Uh, I think you'll learn a lot. So. Yeah, it's a live webinar, so hope to see you there. Very good. I'm Austin Reed. You're watching Central Valley Talk. We'll be back with another guest coming up shortly.